Hello everybody and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Chris. Thank you for subscribing, watching. Please share and please tell your friends to subscribe by hitting the subscribe button. Today we are going to be looking at the Unify USW Flex. And what is this? Well, this is one of the new products that uh, Unify has out. And essentially, with this you can expand your network uh, with the full fully manageable Uni Unify Switch Flex 5 port managed gigabit PoE network switch from Ubiquiti. So essentially, I have areas uh, inside my house, outside my house, where maybe I ran only one, one line, uh, one Cat6. So today we're gonna be looking at my shed. I ran one Cat6 line out there for a outdoor access point um, mesh system. But I wanna also put a PoE camera out there as well. So I'm going to use this device uh, to be able to do that. And it's designed for both indoor and outdoor use. It's five port, like I said. Also, um, it's four auto sensing ports to deliver 802.3 AF PoE output to connected devices such as network security cameras. And that's what I will be doing in this case. All right. Uh, right now I have about six or eight cameras and I want to use this to mount some more cameras uh, PoE wise where I only ran one CAT6 cable. So this also features a host of flexible mounting options on the wall, ceiling, pole. It's got magnetic backing, so you securely attach it to a steel surface. Uh, I'm not really gonna go over the specifics of the device itself, uh, but why I'm using it and what it can do for you uh, in the event you do need to expand your network and you need a solution that does allow for um, POE output, okay? And the beauty of this, it's good for indoors and outdoors. So it runs from a temperature range of about negative 40 Fahrenheit to 131 degrees. So you're not gonna see that where we are in New York. So um, this is the perfect uh, device for that. And it's not that expensive. Uh, it comes in about $99. So, so excuse the mess here. Um, I have a data center which is still being worked on here, as you can see, uh, using Ubiquiti equipment. And we have essentially 18 zone uh, audio indoor and outdoor which we're running off the Apple AirPlay all right and we have our switches here and our cable boxes down there and we have ports all around the house uh, every room's got at least uh, one or two and uh, and once we don't have two we're using one of the unified products to expand um, the usability there all right we're running uh, Verizon Fios a gigabit all right but we do have tablets uh, throughout the house, ports, and uh, everything else that you'll need. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go out to the shed where I had run only one Cat6 cable, all right? And that's being used for an access point. And we wanna expand over there so we can actually install a Amcrest PoE camera. All right, so as you can see on my shed over there, we have a Ubiquities access point, which is supplied by uh, direct Cat6 Ethernet connection underground from the house. But uh, I made a mistake. I didn't put two or three Ethernet lines over here. And so I want to now expand it. And that's what I'm going to do now. And I'm going to use this flex to do just that. What I do want to do is go off of the line I have coming over here. There's one single Cat6 line. Which you can see, it's a little dark, but it comes in through here. And I'm then going to connect that to this device here, which we will open up. And this is the USW Flex. All right, and that'll give me the ability to hook up that access point out there as well as a Amcrest 4k 8 megapixel poe and you can see when i open this up it's pretty well made solid and it's actually a cover here which will cover the ethernet jacks okay when you do plug it in as it's waterproof uh, indoor outdoor use and high and low temperatures Okay guys, just to reiterate, so the original Cat6 cable coming into my shed from the house is coming through here. I cut this off 
because this is going to be the source of the uh, power into the flex um, switch there, okay? And then I go ahead and reconnect the access point uh, to the flex device. So the part that actually takes the longest is on winding the Cat6 cables, uh, putting uh, ends on them and crimping them and that's pretty much uh, it and then we'll attach it and see how it goes. Alright so as you can see we plugged in that Ethernet cable, Cat6 cable into the USW flex and we have a uh, power light on, uh, blinking, connecting to the network. We can now go ahead and plug in our other devices into this and uh, we should be good from there. So what I'm going to do now is that I have the outdoor access point uh, connected and PoE and we're all powered up. I have a little actually heavy duty magnet there I'm going to put on there and I'll attach this to the back of this. Even though this does actually have magnetic, um, it's not going to be strong enough for my application right now. And we are completely hung, powered up, it's hung by magnets and it's very strong. And so now we have added an additional number of ports that we can use for multiple different cameras and so on. If you have any questions, comments, please share and uh, please subscribe. Please. Uh, Tell your friends about it and uh, have a great day.